Okay, uh, this is WXRT. Yes. We've been on Belmont Avenue. You know, we didn't just show up last week. We've been here for over 30 years. First thing you see, <laughs> these are all artists that have come in here and been interviewed, hung out at the station. <laughs> these are all curios and and platinum records. Wow. And I know I saw uh, Soul Asylum, I think. Soul, better than Ezra Love Blondie, it. Porno for Pyros, Robert Cray, Smithery. These are all artists. We've uh, Lenny Kravitz, uh, Matthew Sweet. Journey, this is kind of a joke, because we never really played much Journey, but for some reason they sent us a, a, a quintuple platinum. Who's crying now, Journey? You sh maybe that's because they want you to play Journey more. Uh, that's absolutely that's probably true, the case. but it, it didn't work. Now our our uh, library kind of overflows out of the out of the studio, so this is <laughs> like bit. overflow stuff. Look at this; these are record albums. Freak Out. Uh, I Mothers know that. Mother's Invention from 1966. Freak Out, and this Freak. was the uh, you know before there were computers, so you could log everything in place. I can't even imagine. People wrote down the date when they played it. This is how you kept track of stuff. Wow. XRT. You took a colored pen, color coded, so it was your date part. You know the time you were on. If you were overnight, you were brown. A lot of this stuff has been so do replaced I still play by, records? Oh, all the time, oh. sure. <laughs> Absolutely. A lot of these have been replaced by CDs, of course. Uh, and then some of them, and some of the records in the studio are things that we haven't replaced. PDQ Bach. You don't see PDQ Bach record albums anywhere else. Really top flight bathroom. This is our music savant right here, John Ooh. Frieda. Wave at the camera, it's nude hippo. They've come to visit. <laughs> so this is what you do when you're the music director. You go. Yeah, no, no, not a chance. <laughs> no, no, we can't do that. There's oh, always music in here, because every day you get, you know, you get a pile of new CDs. From new artists? From new artists, yeah. Wow. So why don't you just play all the songs that you like? Or do you have to be somewhat well, unbiased? It's not my radio. It's oh, there we go, that's right. You see, the, right. The, the hope is that more than just Him the will music listen. director will listen. <laughs> or the disc jockey. We said we needed storage for record albums and CDs. Yeah. So they jumped right in the fray and they got us gym lockers. So nice. This is the on air studio. Can we just bust in? Um we <laughs> uh, uh. Hey Terry, this is Patrice from Nude Hippo. Hi! <laughs> Hi, I'm sorry. I'm no, that's okay. Hi, how are you? Sorry. sorry. I mean This is where it all happens. <laughs> Those are the record albums that we still Whoa. play up there, and the walls of compact discs, and jazz records, and uh, it's new releases Thursday, so she's getting to showcase some cool new music today. Now, some radio stations have all their music in Broke. the computer. Oh, yeah, yeah, I knew that. Oh, really? So she actually picks, like, hand picks them? So, you see those 1985 vintage CD players? Yeah. We're actually using actual CDs and see the turntables? Yeah. We're using the turntable CDs to play them because they discovered we had too many songs to put into a computer database. The computer oh, couldn't handle it. Yeah. Now, Terry is the uh, reigning veteran of WXRT Air staff members. She started working here in 1973. 1882. 1882. <laughs> okay, she's on the air. Bye, thank you. People think they want to be a disc jockey, and then they realize they have to work nearly three hours a day. Oh, and for a lot of that's people, too much. That's, that's too, too much. much. It really is a museum, this place. It should be after it all should. these years. You should charge admission and open your front door. Why don't you guys expand your facilities here? <laughs> I'm like, why don't, you, why don't you gut this wall? Did you hear her? And you thought she was just doing uh, stuff for New Hippo. She's also a comedian. <laughs> Why don't we expand? You know what? Because it costs money. Okay. And we've already, by locating the station at 4949 West Belmont, uh, spent so much money on real estate that expanding. You, you know, in this area, you can't, you can't buy land in this area. Is that that's a radio tower? That's a radio tower. Wow. We don't, it's taller than the Washington Monument. Is it really? Yes, it is. Who knew? I've never even saw, I've never even seen this thing on Belmont. Like, well, yeah, it's, it. it's easy to miss because it's only 800 feet tall. <laughs> you never saw it before. This place is ridiculous. <laughs> you have now gone more in depth yes. with a tour of XRT this than anybody in history. Really? Yeah, and I can tell I, you why. Why? Because nobody else cares. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>
This has been a presentation of Old Pie Productions. Tony, can you shut up? <laughs>